There are lots of soccer fans here in South Florida, but finding a field to play on can be tough. But that's about to get kicked up a notch thanks to some teamwork between Miami-Dade County and the U.S. Soccer Federation. Local 10's Alex Finney is live to show us. Alex. Well, Nicole and Calvin, you know, in this Miami Gardens neighborhood, there was a focus group that was held here three years ago. And the number one thing that people said they wanted was a soccer field. And now that is all about to become a reality for so many children. As we know, this is a sport that is widely loved by a lot of people. And this is so great for the South Florida community. Take a look. And what can I say? It's an exciting time to be a soccer fan in the U.S. That it is. Get ready for more soccer in South Florida. I really like playing soccer. Meet high school senior Cariana Pugh, heading to Texas A&M on a soccer scholarship. I'm super excited. It's always been my dream to play college soccer. And now more and more kids will be able to follow in her footsteps. This is the site of one of 50 mini pitches coming to Miami. The impact will be tremendous. The investment will not only expand our soccer programming, but it's going to allow us to reach many, many young people who do not currently have access to this critical sport. Over the next six years, soccer will have a positive impact on more than 30,000 kids in Miami. Thank you for leading the charge with the first pitch. This Miami-Dade soccer initiative also possible thanks to a $5 million donation from Citadel founder and CEO Kenneth C. Griffin. This means more access and more mini pitches in smaller communities as well. The opportunity for soccer to be played here in the city of Miami Gardens is going to be incredible. Yes, the World Cup is coming. Miami preparing to host the FIFA World Cup 2026. There are 230 million registered soccer players in the world and, and billions of fans. We are a part of a global community and this is our sport. Very, very exciting. It was so great to watch all the kiddos. They were bouncing that ball today. Just very excited for this mini pitch to come to this neighborhood. Now, as for the plan in terms of how they're going to be rolling all of this out, that is still to be seen. But $10 million being pumped into this initiative, definitely a step in the right direction for the South Florida community. And I can't say it enough, but certainly for all of our children that are so interested in sports. For now, that's the very latest live in Miami Gardens tonight. Alex Finney, Local 10 News.